Sean, what's, what's your favourite thing about Christmas? My favourite day is not uh, is the 28th, which is like a little island between sort of heartburn and headache. <laughs> 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 Just in between the two. But it's, Christmas isn't my favourite day of the year. What's, what's your favourite day? My favourite day of the year is that day. Uh, it's a bit like Easter, it doesn't have an exact date. It's the day the flying ants come out. <laughs> <laughs> And you just take, take you by surprise. You, if you, it turns out you're on holiday, I'm like, oh, bollocks. <laughs> 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 what, what's, uh, what's this? Uh, it's my new thing, Jimmy. Your new thing? I arrange fruit. Find something that was uh, I could express my creative side, and I could I could it was soothing, relaxing. It was something that I just I went on a course, <laughs> and I never looked back. As soon as I stepped in there with ghee, um, <laughs> it just set me free. It literally just set me free. And uh, he taught me. I mean, I've, the reason I've gone it, I've done one bowl of fruit that I've arranged, right, and one. Just stay, I think they, one, of the, one of the production team <laughs> did this. That looks like a zookeeper's bucket, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's a disgrace. But my skills aren't just... Disgrace. <laughs> ah, I'm not, I haven't finished yet. My skills aren't just with fruit. Once I realised I had this talent, I found Gift. I could do it with biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I just emptied a tin and just went like that. <laughs> but as we all know, today is a very special day. It's, of course, National Bring Your Nephew to Work Day. <laughs> so I've brought my nephew in. So I'd like you to, to welcome my, my nephew. Sean's, Sean's nephew. <laughs> all right, could you tell us a little bit about your nephew, Sean? What's his name? Donny. They are Donny, so wave everyone. <laughs> Lovely little fellow, isn't he? I used to bounce him on my knee. I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> who's, whose child is Donny? Oh, he's one of them. You know. <laughs> Nobody really wants to claim him. <laughs> <laughs> I got a, a letter, a filthy letter, from a gentleman who told me in his opening line that he was 85 and he put all the rudest words in Latin. Oh, nice. I genuinely can't think of anything filthier. Yeah. <laughs> it's a weird thing to do, Sean. Why'd you do it? <laughs> I'm just, uh, I speak a Latin, that's how I do it. <laughs> <laughs> I speak a Latin, I that's how I do it. Yes, Sean is doing the Latin accent. <laughs> <laughs> Come and go, hey. Bada bing, that's Latin, isn't it? <laughs> You know, everyone enjoys a coffee table book. Mm. Something that they can pour over any time they want. Sure. You know, something special, something beautifully made. And uh, I come up with a beautiful coffee table book. And we know, you know the expression, fit as a butcher's dog? Yes. Mm. I thought, what about a baker's dog? <laughs> <laughs> so this, this book's called Fit as a Baker's <laughs> Dog. <laughs> And it features, you know, some dogs who, through the sympathetic look in their eyes, they can wheedle a snack out of the most hard-hearted of owners. So that's uh, Buttercup. There. <laughs> that's Duke. Oh, he's great. Look at him. Is Duke a dog or a seal? <laughs> Duke, actually, he's a bit of a record holder. Really? He hasn't had a crap for nine months. <laughs> <laughs> Postponed. Oh, is that us? What? Oh. Postponed. 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 It's Mark Jackson. I thought you said postponed. Postponed. Well, let's have a look and see, shall we? Yes, it is postponed. This time of year, we're approaching winter. Everyone's starting to get concerned about, you know, the yeah. possibility of uh, certain illnesses that are rife. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, but there are various c 
skulls and germs. And a lot of people these days, they're, they're trying out you know, the sort of supplements, yeah. you know, uh, immune-boosting things, because we're all too... Everyone's too sanitised and hygienic these days, and I think they're going in the wrong direction. So what I've come up with as an idea is uh, a way of really boosting your immune system the natural way, which right. is with a bin. <laughs> What I've got here... Why is there a tap on that bin? Bin, because <laughs> what I do is I drink the juice. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> and that is a lovely immune-boosting... Oh. <laughs> I need something. It needs something extra to, um, to, to give it some flavour. <laughs> There we go. That, get that in there. <laughs> Give it a bit of extra flavour, and that'll help you through the. Um... <laughs> yeah. How come he's really good at this? <laughs> <laughs> Just throw in a spot. <laughs> <laughs> Just because I'm the only one who took the trouble and the effort to bring a nephew in. <laughs> So, Sean, it's only just a, just a super quick thing. Just without without looking at Donny, I'd like you on the count of three to name Donny's mum. It's just super simple. It's just for me. <laughs> He's adopted. <laughs> <laughs> you bastard! Why <won't> <laughs> are Sorry, sorry. <laughs> and then I thought, well, why not expand the book? <laughs> That looks like a flamingo that's let itself go. <laughs> oh, here's Poppy. <laughs> you wouldn't think carrots could do that to a rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, my God. Here's Harley. Excellent. The only way he'd catch a mouse is if he landed on it. <laughs> 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 this is, can this be the rest of the show? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's favourite. <laughs> it's Rusty! <laughs> <laughs> and will this be in all good bookstores? Everyone, every single place you can imagine, <laughs> railway stations. <laughs> we're going to also drop them into war zones. <laughs> just to make people go, yeah, what are we doing? <laughs> Sean, how did you do it? Oh, we get five, you take three away, he leaves with two, doesn't it, Rachel? Yep. Then you take that two off the 75. What have you got, Rachel? 73, Sean. Yes. Well, what would you do with that? I would times it by eight. Yeah. That's a good thing. Oh, come... No. No way. <laughs> There's no way that happens. What's that? What does that leave, Rachel? You're 50 away, Sean. There's 50. Yeah, only 50 away. Oh, we've got a 50. Oh. Why don't you take it off? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well bullshit. No. <laughs> Sometimes you can just see it. It just. <laughs> oh. Who is he? <laughs> Dummy. <laughs> No, if you've got a problem with my nephew... I have, a little bit. I'm <laughs> imagining if I saw a picture of you two in the paper and it said paedophile and victim, I wouldn't know which was which. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Donny, why don't you go and get yourself some crisps? <laughs> God, they don't trust you, Donny. Sorry about these people. They're cynical. They've worked in television a long time. <laughs> so, uh, Thanks for coming on. I'll see you later. Just stay in my dressing room. You must get a lot of presents at Christmas, Sean. <laughs> yeah, of course I do. What, what, what do you do with your unwanted I'm so gifts? so popular. Uh, it depends on the size. If I can get them over the back wall, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> to me, this is what I sincerely believe, I think all gifts are unwanted. I think all gifts. Because I don't believe in uh, owning things, in material possessions. I'm a bit like a Cherokee. I think by owning <laughs> something, you kill its intrinsic beauty, whatever it is attractive about it is killed by the ownership of it, so <laughs> I just prefer the cash. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny! What? I just wanted to check. I'll meet you. Come and sit. I'll just tell you where I'm going to meet you. <laughs> I'll meet you in the car park <laughs> afterwards. Uh, it's the blue car, so I'll meet you. Just might just, might just sit there. <laughs> so he's sitting there for the conundrum, is he? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Could you make this face? any harder for us? <laughs> We're shit at this. I'm dyslexic. He went to Rada. They've got a fucking ringer in. No, <laughs> my nephew. Surely <laughs> <laughs> you stick it to the story. He's your nephew. Yeah. Has your nephew ever been on Countdown before? Yes, he's the. He's. Uh, were you the champion? I was champion in 2014. <laughs> of course, Jimmy. It's only. Well, it's only Mark. 
Murray. Murray? 